everyone, it's Melanie from the Midland Public Library Maker Place, and we're making your winters a little cozier with our Snug Saturdays. To make a single serving of hot chocolate from scratch, you will need one and a quarter cups of milk, two tablespoons of cocoa, two tablespoons of sugar, one ounce of chocolate that's chopped or chips, a little splash of vanilla, a sauce pot, a whisk, and a mug. Start making your hot chocolate by pouring milk into your saucepan. When you realize you don't have the burner on, go ahead and set the heat to medium. Then add your cocoa powder and sugar. Whisk everything together, and if you don't have a whisk, a spoon will work just fine. You're going to be stirring this the whole time, partly to make sure everything is well blended, and partly because milk on a stove can go really wrong really quickly if you're not paying attention. Quick note about milk, you can use whatever kind you like. The higher the fat content, the richer your hot chocolate. I'm using skim because that's what was in my fridge. When you think it's starting to get warm, grab a spoon and do a quick taste test. If it is, in fact, warm, go ahead and add your chocolate and your splash of vanilla, and then back to your regularly scheduled stirring. Once the chocolate pieces seem to be fully melted, keep testing periodically until your hot chocolate is at your perfect drinking temperature. Carefully pour your hot chocolate into your mug. If you're nervous about pouring straight from the pot to the mug, you can do like I did and transfer it to something larger with a pouring spout first, like my liquid measuring cup. Once your hot chocolate is in your mug, you can dress it up however you want. Marshmallows, whipped cream, a sprinkle of cinnamon. If you like orange chocolate, try adding some orange zest. Mint chocolate, add peppermint extract or crushed mint candy. If you like a little spice with your sweets, add some chili powder. As for me, I'm going simple and drinking it just like this. Enjoy!